It's called PodCamp, and it helps people navigate the web's most popular websites. The conference today at Holyoke Community College mixed social media newcomers and experts. ABC 40's Stephanie Officer has the story. A PodCamp, you ask? A PodCamp is a social media unconference. It's an unconference in that we don't have a set agenda ahead of time. We determine the sessions based on what people want to talk about this very morning. The event was held at Holyoke Community College. It catered to a variety of internet users, both new and seasoned. And I guess for the younger people, it's just more natural. And then us older folks, we appreciate um, the uh, how special it is compared to how life used to be even just five years ago. Morris helps organize the annual event. The idea was borrowed from a 2007 Boston pod camp, and he just might be glad he ran with the thought. I met my girlfriend here after the first pod camp Western Mass, so, so yes, there have been relationships that form here. Morris's girlfriend Leslie describes how the couple came to be. We met at the first pod camp Western Mass uh, three years ago and just met as business acquaintances and followed up with each other via Twitter and some tweet ups that were held in the Western Mass area and a few months later we became an item. And that's exactly the point of an event like this, to connect those who wouldn't ordinarily meet. We're here to bring forward the education but learn ourselves as well. And I learned about Twitter fashion. Are those Twitter earrings? They are. <laughs> Did you even find something like that? On Etsy. <laughs> What's Etsy? <laughs> Etsy is a site where crafters who make uh, jewelry and handmade goods sell their, their products. In Holyoke, I'm Stephanie Officer, ABC 40. Twitter earrings, who would have thought? The PodCamp offers workshops on Twitter, Facebook, and the up-and-coming Pinterest.